Familial chylomicronemia syndrome, or FCS, is a rare disease that can have serious consequences. Never heard of FCS? Don't feel bad. Neither have a lot of healthcare providers. To make things more difficult for patients and healthcare providers, FCS is also called by other names, including lipoprotein lipase deficiency, LPLD, familial hyperlipidemia, and Fredrickson type 1. FCS has signs and symptoms that are often confused with or identified with other, more common conditions, so it is often misdiagnosed. For instance, severe abdominal pain or pancreatitis, which can be fatal. Another symptom includes extremely high triglycerides, which is caused by uncontrolled buildup of chylomicrons, or small fat globules in the bloodstream. One telltale sign is milky or fatty blood. Taken together, these symptoms are a sign of FCS, familial chylomicronemia syndrome. Familial means it is inherited. In this genetic disease, the body can't break down chylomicrons, or fats in the blood, which result in extremely high triglyceride levels. The uncontrolled buildup of chylomicrons and triglycerides leads to acute complications and chronic signs and symptoms. Patients often have feelings of fatigue and or nausea and may experience memory loss or forgetfulness. And having this disease can lead to other characteristics of this syndrome that doctors may notice, which include swelling of the liver and spleen, xanthomas or fatty deposits in the skin, usually on the arms, buttocks, and or knees. Beyond physical complications, FCS affects multiple aspects of daily life. Patients report feelings of anxiety, isolation, or even depression. If you're experiencing symptoms of FCS, it is important to write them down and share them with your doctor. FCS is rare and not well understood, so it's important to be your own advocate to educate others, including your family and your healthcare providers, about the condition. The first step to living a better life with FCS is to receive a diagnosis which considers clinical history and your triglyceride levels and removing other causes of high triglycerides, which include alcohol abuse, uncontrolled diabetes, certain medications, or medical conditions. Treatment begins with lifestyle and diet changes. Patients must limit fat intake to 10 to 15 grams daily and avoid alcohol and simple carbohydrates. Endocrinologists are usually equipped to treat FCS. You can find a specialist at hormone.org. It's important for patients with FCS to know they're not alone. Connect with a community who knows your challenges and is ready to help. Go to fcsfocus.com.